Good morning everyone. Welcome to a very blurry-eyed 23rd of December here in New Zealand. Uh, it's an overcast day. I have no idea what the weather is supposed to be. Uh, right. Oh gosh. I feel like I'm out of practice because I've missed one day. <laughs> okay. Just a week recap of yesterday. Uh, as some of you know, my mother was having a minor operation yesterday. Her operation lasted 30 minutes-ish. We were at the hospital for 12 hours and she stayed in overnight so she's still there currently so her, her operation was delayed in the morning because the person before her was a slightly longer operation than the nursing staff realized uh, and then afterwards it took six hours to find a bed in the hospital for her so I have spent 11 of those 12 hours sitting on a very uncomfortable chair in a day surgery unit <laughs> so yes so we'll be back today for more but it won't be 12 hours worth today supposedly she's meant to come home but it depends on what she did overnight so we'll find out anyway let's crack on to the 23rd of December uh, it's the final day of the mystery advent calendar from Karen's USA adventure so we'll cross that off the list today um, I'm going to go relatively quickly and hopefully not waffle too much, so I'm not going to show the bits today, other than the Karen box probably, um, and I'll show all the boxes again for a last time tomorrow. Um, that's because I'm going to be making a second video directly after this, because I got a haul yesterday, so I want to do it, get that at least filmed now and out of the way, it won't go up today. Um, <clears throat> Probably won't go up to after Christmas in reality. I just want to get it filmed though. Uh, okay, I am seeing on the screen the colour going in and out. And again, it's because I've had to put the lights on and they're bouncing off this tinsel, what's it call it. Uh, so I apologise if, if your, your colour is going. See, we're nice and bright now and it'll sort of start to look like it's going black and white shortly. So I apologise in advance for that. Um, I know next year not to wear a tinsel headband. <laughs> right, let's crack on with some chocolate. As far as being up to date, uh, yeah, no, I'm now behind on everything other than eating the chocolate. Uh, and I'm just going to run with it. I don't, uh, you know, when I started doing this, she wasn't going to the hospital. So uh, I think that's a, oh, it's a little elf. You might see it better on the chocolate version. Um, now one of these I've opened wrong, it's not this one. He's a little bit hard to tell, but it's a little elf with his hands in the air. You can see his hat at the top. Oh, nearly sent it flying across the room. Right, so that one we opened the 23rd, so we need to open the 22nd. And this was another blob. Now this is the real blob. I have no idea what this blob is. No idea. It's a blob of chocolate. Second to last quality street. But fear not, I have a tin now. Not a tin actually, the plastic tub. I relented. I saw it on a very good special for us here in New Zealand. Obviously because it's the lead up to Christmas. I got it on Monday I think. Um, so things are already starting to be reduced that are sort of definite Christmas things, and the Quality Street tub was one of them, so I relented and brought it. Uh, there's the 24th. So we're looking for the 23rd. There's the 23rd. Really? I thought we'd got them all out of the way. It's an orange one. <clears throat> Specifically, orange cream. So... I have no idea what the last one's going to be. I can't even find 24 now. It's being smacking them. Don't look. <laughs> I nearly looked. Okay. Second to last pack of tea. I wasn't going to show them all, was I? Oh, well. <clears throat> Today's tea is called Three Licorice. A sweet song of flavoursome licorice from Kazakhstan, Georgia and Egypt. Um, it, it, Kazakhstan, let's try that again. <clears throat> K 
Kazakhstan licorice root, Georgian licorice root, Egyptian li What? No fennel? <laughs> right. Let's give this a... S On paper, this should be drinkable for me because I like licorice. Um, <clears throat> the one thing it's not for me is the licorice colour. It's Licorice is black. Uh, and this looks like... Piddle. <laughs> and it doesn't smell like licorice. Oh, I'm not wasting time drinking it if it's not nice. It's hot. Oh. But it's got a very strong licorice taste. Interestingly, not the smell but definitely the taste. Is it drinkable? It could be drinkable. I'll have one more sip and then I'll try it again afterwards. Because it is quite hot. Definitely. Um, I think I could probably drink that actually and I might afterwards. Okay, my hot chocolate, second to last hot chocolate. I can't remember what it was last time. Oh yeah. I can't remember if I actually tried this one or not. It's the Rocky Road hot chocolate. No, I did try it, I think. Uh, flavours of marshmallow, cherry and biscuit. It's the cherry that puts me off because I don't like cherry flavour. Okay, uh, you can go there. Um, I will show the movie for Rebecca. <laughs> I doubt that... Um, <clears throat> I doubt I'm going to get there at all. Uh, it's got a little reindeer and I don't know if you can tell. He's got a little glittery bow. Very sweet. Okay. Princess and the Frog. It's a shame. I would like to try and get there. I'm hoping we're home by mid-afternoon today. I'm going in. I'm not allowed to arrive before 11. I have to ask permission to arrive before 11. Which on every other ward she's been in hasn't been an issue because she is a dementia patient. And quite frankly, if you go in early, you are helping them out by not having to get the staff involved every time she wants to move. But not this ward. We have to ask permission. So sod them. They can cope with her till 11 o'clock this morning. <laughs> um, I'm hoping, A, that she comes home. And then, if not, I will be leaving the hospital mid-afternoon. Um, I've still got to collect medications unrelated to the hospital trip. Her usual medications have to be collected today. Um, that farm, the pharmacy rang up, left a message on my phone panicking because she needs them for the 25th and that still hadn't been collected. Don't worry, love, it's under control. <laughs> All right, the pins. We've only got two left. It's the 23rd, it's a tight lid. It's a nice, got a Christmas tree under there, I think. Right, Olaf, Mushu, Gus Gus. Chippendale. Um, how are we going? What have we got left? Three things left to do. Uh, for those who are following along, you will know there's there hasn't been a photo. Oh, when did I put the photo up? Did I do a photo on Monday? Maybe not. I don't know. Oh, okay. This is Aurora, Sleeping Beauty, Believe in Your Dreams. That's actually quite a nice pin. She's got a horror face, but um, if you don't look at her face too much, <laughs> um, I'm not going to be able to get you to see the face properly. Potentially could be kept. Um, we'll see. I will do a dedicated pin video, but probably not till next week, and it'll just be pins. Oh, okay. 
2020 with Chip and Dale. I think we might just keep that one. We were spent, meant to be there in 2020. We might, that might go in the keeping pile. That's a good end. Uh, okay. Um, book. I'll hold the book up tomorrow. How are we going? Ten minutes. The Journey North. All, El all her life, Elsa has wondered why she was born with powers and why they continue to grow. Then, when a mysterious voice calls to her, Hello. Uh, Elsa, Anna and their friends embark on the, a journey north further than they've ever been before. So, oh, it does say. <laughs> I was going to say, that sounds like Frozen 2 to me and it's there, Frozen 2. Yeah, good one, Rach. Right, I'll deal with that later. Uh, right, let's do this one and we'll do the Christmas Village last. So, today is the final day of the mystery box that I got from Karen's USA Adventures. It's a 12-day advent calendar, but uh, if you've been following along, as opposed to just watching this one video, I've been opening them every other day on the odd day of the month, so 23rd is the last day. Um, so, the 23rd is something that feels like it could be breakable. In quite a nice little pouch. Okay. I wonder if this is something I've looked at on Shop Disney before. Ah, oh. uh, okay. Oh my goodness. It is a Christmas drinking tumbler. And you know why I went, ah, oh, okay. If you've watched the other box video, do you recognise that one? That's the plate. So it's part of the same set. Look at Goofy. So we've got um, a house, or possibly castle, Pluto pulling a tray, Mickey wrapping a teddy bear, Minnie doing something, painting something, a teacup. A gingerbread house like a castle <laughs> Donald Pluto and Daisy oh my goodness so it's got a fancy oh it's too white fancy lid there's something inside <gasps> there's something inside oh my goodness there's a little pouch inside what have we got oh. <laughs> We've got some hot chocolate. There's some galaxy hot chocolate. There's a galaxy chocolate bar. Gosh, I haven't had galaxy for donkeys. And a little marshmallow. Oh, God. There we go. Oh, my goodness. What I love absolutely love is that it matches the plate that I got in the other box it's the other if I I'll try and remember to bring the plate tomorrow and show you never had a drinking cup like this very pleased very pleased um, yeah I'll just shove it all back in there for now and I'll deal with this box <sighs> further down the list take everything out That was a great end to that box. Very pleased with that. Okay. And the last thing. Uh, now, I got told by one of my viewers in Aussie, I believe. Maybe. She must be an Aussie. Why would she be looking otherwise? Um, there is a website in Australia, which I then looked at, that ships to Australia and New Zealand people, called littleadventboxes, or one word, dot com dot au because she told me she picked up an, the another advent calendar by Little Lulabelle, which is who this is by. So I went looking in research for next year and accidentally saw the picture for this. So um, I was right on one thing and wrong on one thing. So we have two more days left to open. 
All right. So back at the beginning of the week, I'd, I said we'd have, um, so what have we got? Day, Wednesday, Tuesday, Monday. Yeah. I said we would have another box of presents, three houses and Santa. So the box of presents that I thought was in Monday was a candy cane. Uh, and then we got a house. And today we have a sleigh of presents. So I was partly right. <laughs> Just didn't think about the sleigh. Does it stand up? It stands up. Excellent. That's really sweet. Um, okay, so that is done. We'll do the final one tomorrow. That is everything done for the Advents. Excuse me. Drinking, drinking, talking. Right, I am going to, I'm going to watch this back shortly, but I'm going to actually make another video right now after this. Uh, you will see that if you wish to next week. Um, so, have a good evening of the 22nd or uh, day of the 23rd. I hope you are all under control. I am actually amazingly under control because... Uh, I had a week to know that she was going into hospital, so I got a lot of stuff done last week. All I have to get is perishable stuff. Um, and because I have to, where I collect her medications from, there is a supermarket. I'm actually going to try and get that done today if I can. Otherwise, I'll be out early tomorrow morning at first opening to my local supermarket here. That's my plan. So if we can cross it off the list today, that would be really good. But um, I thought tomorrow was a backup. Otherwise, we won't be having any trifle. Because <laughs> I'll have no cream or custard. Right. Um, I think that is everything I need to tell you guys. Uh, hopefully this is all fine because we won't be reshooting. And I will catch you tomorrow for the last day. Amazingly. I can't believe it's that close to Christmas. Um... Anyway, have a good one. I'm going to stop waffling. I'm going to whip the tinsel off and make another video. I will catch you tomorrow. Bye, everyone.